Hello, Mark here on the Culinary Compass uh, here in Montreal. Found a fish and chips place, Brit and Chips, and uh, honestly, authentic, really awesome. Um, the way I uh, judge whether or not someplace is authentic before I even eat the food, um, a Brit and Chips type place is to see whether or not they have malt vinegar on the table. They have malt vinegar on the table. That's one great thing. Also, when you look at the menu, there's only one thing on it, fish and chips. The fish is superb. They're really excellent, very well priced. I'm paying about $11 Canadian. Fried, perfectly good. Really great. The chips, the chips are okay. You know, I, I like my chips really super crispy. That's like... These are, like, and I even asked for I'm them to be. I think I probably could have sent it back, fries, but I wasn't in the mood tonight. But you know what? And a diet They're okay. I'll survive with them. <laughs> the tar <laughs> sauce is horseradish, <laughs> mostly, with some cream, yes. mayonnaise, and it's also excellent. And really, the, the most wonderful part, of, not of the meal, but just great thing, is that they, they pickle their own onions. And again, you know, Pickled in-house, they have some baked beans that are made in-house, so really authentic, and of course, to come with it, a really nice, simple ale on tap. So, when in Montreal, if you're looking not just for French food, and you're not going to Chinatown or Little Italy, um, this is definitely a good destination. It's on McGill Street. Again, look below this video, and you will be able to see the map of the Culinary Compass uh, map of places, go to Montreal, and you will see this listed there. Um, good food, great price, um, yeah, all in all, I would say definitely if you have more than three nights in Montreal, or three nights and you're hankering for just some of this stuff, you really won't be disappointed. So, for the Culinary Compass, ciao for now.